Hello and welcome to what is possibly the final episode of Parasite Zeta Random Facts. Sentry turrets will attack radio jams. Disarm kits are able to disarm various items, such as... But for some reason, the radio jammer is exempt from this list. At the, at the main blood tester, if you zoom in, you will notice that you will see Stedman's research from, wing, from the Wings of Liberty campaign. Area scatter devices can be used to see through doors. And you can even shoot things on the other side of the door. This is particularly useful when defending hens. The SCV suit has a janitor kit and can build structures. However, holding a piece of Solarite will disable ability to use the janitor kit or to build structures. It will also disable repairing, however, SCV Overdrive will not be disabled, allowing you to move faster. You are also still able to attack using your SCV. SCV suits will not regenerate energy while you are holding Solarite. However, if you drop the Solarite, you will continue to regenerate energy like normal. If your ship is damaged, you will be unable to enter it with your SCV suit until it is repaired to full health. This however can be bypassed by holding a piece of Solarite which will disable your repair ability. While you are under the effects of psionic barrier, doors will not open for you. Psy Heal can be used to heal zoo animals. In older versions of Zeta, you would have noticed that Synth Speed would have given you 3.4 base movement speed. This was changed on the 5th of October 2021 to actually give you only 3.1 speed. However, sprinting now grants you bonus attack speed. Protoss units will attack and kill zoo animals. Enhanced targeting for the android will remove the damage penalty of recon rifle while it is cloaked. If the exit of a closet is blocked by structures such as barricades, you will teleport the shortest distance required to get out. This can be abused to teleport into pens. A syndicate stash can be completely hidden by placing it within a vertical closet. However, the same cannot be done for horizontal closets. There are various doodads on the map that you can place your stash within to hide it completely. However, 
placing your stash in some spots will cause it to disappear completely. This is because you can only place your stash on walkable terrain. Crystal of the Weary Traveler not only teleports yourself, but also teleports any unit around you. This even includes certain units that are not supposed to be able to be removed from certain locations. and the Moon Yetis are on the same team. Here's another example of where the Thor boss can end up. Automated gas defense activated. Mind the alien will take damage from gas, however, it is if it is evolving, it will not take damage from gas. Mind Aliens evolutions also cannot be cancelled in any way. For some reason, flashbangs will stun ships. This does not prevent them from taking off. Consciousness awakened. I am completely operational. As you know, if you infest two Roomba upgrades, it will join the alien team. What you may not know is that if you are the alien host, you can actually control Roomba and make it do things that it normally cannot do, such as enter vents. It can even enter the spacewalk. Interestingly, it will not be slowed by spacewalk in any way. As you know, the android currently has three chassis selectable in-game. However, there is a fourth chassis that can only be spawned with the developer commands. This is the X-55 Titan, which was planned to be added at some point, but was later removed because it was too OP. For example, it has an auto-attack with four limited uses, but each of these auto-attacks is equivalent to a remote mine explosion. The X-55 Titan also has a, an ability that grants it 750 shields for 12 seconds. The X-55 Titan also has a few passive abilities such as the ability to instantly destroy rubble by walking over it. also has an alternative auto attack, which is not limited in use and does high damage. As you may already know, flashbangs will disable your ability to use elevators and will reduce your vision. What you may not know is that if you are an alien, it will actually disable your ability to headcrab people. Tier 4 Flame is healed by fire. However, when it is evolving to Tier 5, 
its cocoon will actually take damage from fire. However, the fire does not do enough damage on its own to kill them. While you are crap, you cannot enter mechs. Access denied. You also cannot enter closets. Access denied. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out the other two parts, I guess. Some of the facts might be outdated, though. But if you're still watching, I just want to thank you. And, um, yeah, this is the last random facts for Parasite Zeta before Smith's version comes out.